It's Forfang who delights the home crowd. Sunday in Oslo, a second chance for the men to impress on the imposing Holman Colin Large Hill. After Stefan Kraft's victory on Saturday, the local fans were hoping that a Norwegian might take the spoils this time around. It turned out the star turn of the first round was Domin Prijuc. The Slovenian topped the rankings with a huge effort. This bumps all around. Inevitably, Kraft wasn't far behind and Johan Andre Forfang led the home charge. Ryoyu Kobayashi got the rough end of conditions on Saturday and didn't qualify for the final round. Here, the man second in the World Cup rankings was determined to do better, and better it was. The second solid jump giving him a shot at the win. Forfang had his eyes on the prize as well and headed down the in-run to the noise of the Norwegian fans. He just about made the landing but absolutely nailed the distance. Enough to go first. Stefan Kraft was looking to cement his World Cup lead with back-to-back -back wins in Oslo and the Norwegian fans knew he was a threat to Forfang's lead. However, a subpar second jump meant that a 12th win of the season wasn't going to happen. That left the first round leader, Domin Preic. He won in Sapporo this season and was hoping for career win number seven. But like Kraft, his second round jump was way down on his first. Not even enough for a podium place. Second win of the season for Forfang over a month after topping the rankings in Villingen. Uh, I feel that my jumping has been really good uh, lately and uh, every jump I've had here in Holmenkollen uh, has been uh, quite good uh, technical jumps and so I, I knew that if uh, the conditions would let me then I would have a possibility. The raw air standings for the Norwegian leg of the World Cup see Forfang on the hills of Kraft. In the World Cup Kraft still leads but Kobayashi would have been delighted and relieved to be back in the points after Saturday's misfortune. The World Cup stays in Norway, Trondheim the next destination on Tuesday and Wednesday for the Flying Hill of Vikersen next weekend. And remember, the FIS app will keep you up to date with all the action. <laughs>